Hello, my name is Bill and welcome to Mind Your Crypto. Today we have Sun Sandbox Daily Update. Are we going to correct even more? Where are we going in the short term? We are going to discuss everything. Before we begin, do not forget to join the monthly subscription. Patreon slash Mind Your Crypto is the link you will find in the description box and in the comment section or buy me a coffee slash Mind Your Crypto. You will get easy profits through an automated system with 200 altcoins you will know exactly when to buy and exactly when to sell. I have also shared the video in this YouTube channel about how we do it and what are the benefits. Okay, so you will get tons of benefits including a manual system with over 90% win ratio, personal guidance, educational videos to become expert in technical analysis and hold your future in your hands and many, many more benefits. Okay, so thank you for watching. Have a fantastic day wherever you are. Let's go and proceed quickly into the sun. So you can see right now that on sand against Bitcoin chart, we are for sure filling that gap right here, probably around the 0.618 and this line right here, which we found a support pressure back on for December after the crash. Okay. Sun found huge good uh, buying pressure here, but after you can see that we are losing support levels, it's day passes right there, and now we are maybe going a little bit further down. For Sun against Bitcoin chart, I think that we are going into the 0.618, this price label around 0.4096. 75 okay in the meantime you can see that we lost the 0.5 which was a very important support level almost a double top right here as you can see and then we had this support level as our major support if we lost that then we are going further down and here we go we are probably going for sand against bitcoin chart even further down on the daily frame if we go there you can see that we had the double top pattern on the rsi as well okay so we had this and we had this support level in which if we lose the support level this is surely an exit okay and now it seems that we have lost it on the daily frame we will see it though but i think that we have lost it for sure because we need the daily frame to close okay we need the daily frame to let it close and i think that due to the fact that we have a very high risk on the weekly frame i think that sand is going to consolidate a little bit further more you can see that we have a very high risk with the uh with the rsi i'm going to delete all these drawings before so you can see it clearly we have the rsi touching the 92 and from there i told you be careful we might not see a bearish rsi divergence it is not always the case that we are seeing a bearish rsi divergence getting another swing high and from there we are correcting we might correct all the way okay and you can see that the rsi the stochastic rsi is now into an overbought as well still in an overbought now it's going down the line and you can see that on the weekly frame i think that once bitcoin goes upwards and has a major swing high it will underperform against other altcoins i will tell you why because we still have a very high risk and even though sand will make a swing high it won't be able to reach this top right here for sand against bitcoin chart easily okay we are not going there soon enough trust me it will be very very hard to get even there again back on 25 november all right so therefore you should be waiting now and you should be extremely careful for sun against bitcoin chart we are going now to the price analysis and you can see that i have thrown a gun fan on the four hour frame i have squared the chart from 22nd november up to 25 november which we found our all-time high okay and from there i'm just going on and i have the most important support levels one of the most important is the one one that we recently lost you can see back on today actually we recently lost this support level this major line right here because the gunfan lines are very important especially the one one but other lines as well two one can be more important than the one one and so on okay but anyway you can see right now that we are correcting more and more and mainly because we are correcting against bitcoin as well okay so you can see that we are going down uh, getting a bullish rsi divergence is a little bit you know i do not think that this will play out because we have to get lower than the 4.16 around this area even though we have a strong support level at around 4.50 so i will draw the line right here and you can see the major support level that we have around the 4.50 in which we might be finding a, a buying pressure right here okay so at around here 4.50 we might be finding a buying pressure if we get towards this line 
or you can see that if we get a little bit slower there we might be finding after okay so sun will go down and it will be very very difficult right now to just reapproach the previous all time high back now okay you should be a little bit uh careful right now if you bought at the top please remember do not sell in a loss keep your altcoins because someone other will buy the altcoins that you sell in a loss so you have first of all a loss okay and secondly you just lose your altcoins all right so therefore you need to wait a little bit you can see that I am planning on the 4.50 around there to have a major swing high probably towards the upwards. If you bought around this area, for example, around here, and you didn't buy at the top but you are in a loss, then I would suggest you to wait for a significant swing high and then uh, sell. Uh, maybe we are going to the 5.82, maybe we are going a little bit further down to the 5.62, okay? But anyway, just wait a little bit till we see the major swing high from Bitcoin and from the market as well. We are waiting right now, we're waiting patiently. I have the target of the 4.50 in case you want to rebuy, but you have to be extremely careful from now on as i'm telling you and i really believe that we are not approaching the previous high easily for the time being for sand it is yes we are not doing that okay instead you have to be extremely extremely careful so you won't be losing any more money if you want to rebuy sand for the long term then yes you can wait a little bit till we get further down and you can buy for the long term or you can do whatever you want if you trust sand you can buy right now but all i'm saying is that do not risk it right now as on the weekly frame we can consolidate so more so much more okay so you need to wait a little bit do not risk trading and of course pay attention to the four point five okay these uh, support level right here the two one ganfan line thank you for watching do not forget to join our monthly subscription to get easy profits and of course you will get market updates and many many more benefits thank you see you soon with many many more videos bye